So what's the current state of video editing? My editing software of choice currently is Final Cut Pro. However, now things may have changed. And that's because of the emergence of AI. Very few things combine the excitement of AI plus powerful productivity than what I'm about to share with you today. Check the links in the description. You'll be happy you did. In today's date of AI, editing no longer needs to be this tiresome, cumbersome task that's gonna take massively long to accomplish. And when you know how to leverage the powerful features of AI, video editing will become simple, efficient, and creative. So today, I'm gonna show you a video editing tool done with AI that's gonna take your editing and your creativity to a whole new level. We're gonna be taking a look at Filmora by Wondershare. Filmora is a game changer, combining the world of video editing now paired with the amazing capabilities of AI. And just look at these amazing features. Now, the ones I'm sharing today are gonna be specifically for AI. And although we don't have time to go over every single one of them, because there is a ton, we're gonna take a look at four specific AI power tools. AI Music Generator, Video Background Remover, AI Vocal Remover, and then AI Text to Video. Now, I'll admit, at first, I didn't think all of this was possible within a video editing tool, but this is real, and it's very impressive. So one specific feature I really love are all of the templates, the titles and effects that you can use immediately. It really is a one-stop shop. Okay, so let's go ahead and then first start with the first one, AI Music Generator. All right, so here we are in Filmora, and this is gonna be the opening dashboard. The first thing you wanna do is just simply select New Project. Now you're over here in a completely new blank slate. Once you're in here, in order to get started, I just suggest simply just dragging in a piece of media. So what I'm doing is just dragging it over here. There it is, I'll let go, and then instantly, just like that, there is that piece of media. In order to bring it down here at the bottom, again, just simply drag down over here into the timeline, if this pops up, I'm just gonna say keep project settings at 1920 times 1080, and now here we are brand new piece of media. So now let's go ahead and then generate some AI music. In order to do this, you're gonna locate the audio button up here in the top left-hand corner. It's that musical note, select that. Then from there, now you could see that there's a tab that says AI music. Now before generating AI music, you can also notice all of these plethora of options you already have pre-made, but that's gonna be a video for another day. Right now we're focusing on the AI music, okay? Now in order to do this, all you have to do is just simply select a few of these tags. We have mood, theme, and genre to work with. Now, this doesn't allow for you to enter or type a prompt yet, which is okay, because the method Filmora uses a lot of times will just take out a lot of the thinking. And that's exactly what we'll do. I'll come over here and let's just start with the genre. If I select genre, I'll select hip hop. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about a theme, but you could see there are other options here. But when I go to mood, I'm now gonna select epic. Okay, you could select as many of these as you want. I'm just gonna go ahead and go with two. Once you have two that you're happy with, now select this green generate button. Now, it's gonna take about 60 to 90 seconds, but once it's done, you're gonna have a lot of AI music to choose from. So here are the three options it just provided us. We have three epic hip hop tunes. Let's go ahead and preview each one. Not bad. Let's try the second one. Oh, this second one's pretty good. All right, now a quick preview of the third. Now let's go ahead and go to the next thing. And so what we're doing right now is all gonna come together beautifully, which then leads us into our next thing. And this is the one I'm very excited about, video background remover. Okay, so now watch how easy this is. In order to remove the background, I'm gonna go ahead and remove this pink background from this video I just imported. It's this simple. Now, just make sure you have the video selected by clicking on the actual video in the timeline. Then the next step is over here in the top right-hand corner, we have these three options, video, color, and speed. Make Make sure video is selected. From there, you're gonna make sure AI tools is now selected. And now all you have to do is select this button that says AI portrait. Select that on, and then look at that. In one click of a button, just like that, I can't believe how fast and accurate it is. Look at that, it's completely gone, and it does a very impressive job. Now, the importance of being able to use this background remover tool is because of this right here. So what I'll do now is I'm gonna click and drag a brand new file over here in to Filmora. So once my new file is in here, you can see down here at the bottom, I have it below this woman here, and now, check this out. Now, when I hit that play button, now she has a completely new background. However, she's a little bit unbalanced, so I'm gonna click this 
this video again. And now up here in my window, I'm gonna drag her to the bottom so she fits in perfectly with that new video background. And as I hit the play button, look at that. Amazing job. Now let's add the AI music that we just created. I mean, that's amazing how good of a job this did. Okay, now moving on. This next one is another too good to be true feature. And this is gonna be AI vocal remover. Enhance your audio like a pro. Our vocal remover features allow you to remove vocals or specific audio elements from your videos or music tracks for various editing purposes. Now, in order to do this, let's do one more thing. I'm gonna go ahead and then click and drag another file into my timeline and put it right here after this first one. Now, once I hit the play button, you'll see the vocals are currently intact. Barely breathing, don't let go. Okay, so that's how she sounds. This was also AI generated, but let's go ahead and then remove her voice. You're going to come up here to the menu and select tools at the very, very top, then hover over audio, and now you're going to select AI vocal remover. One click of a button, watch this. It's already at 10%, 20. Just give it a few minutes and watch how powerful this actually is. It's completely gone. Now, if I hit the play button, you won't notice a difference. The whisper. Okay, that's because it kept this original audio intact with this video. Very helpful. Now, here are the files right here. What I'll do is I'm gonna go ahead and then move both of these files over here to the left so we can just hear the difference, okay? Now, when I select play, listen to this. Barely breathe. Everything's the same, right? Watch this though. Now let's go ahead and separate these two. It completely removed two files. Here's the first one. So we have just the melody. Very cool. Now this other one over here, listen to this now. Even, don't let go. Hear the whispers, listen close. That is impressive. I know you. It completely removed everything, and now she's singing completely a cappella. How clean that is, is very impressive. Okay, now, last but not least, this one is very powerful as well. We're going to use the AI text-to-video. Effortlessly transform your input text into captivating videos. Our advanced algorithms analyze your content, curate matching stock media, and generate dynamic videos. Hey, I'm back here in the main dashboard, and now we're going to select right here this option that's called AI text-to-video video. Go ahead and select it. This dialog box is going to appear. And this really is this simple. So my text is a little bit small, but all I did was just basically say, let's see what happens if I want to create a video about some of my coaching or consulting services. Okay. If you need additional help, I can do some consulting for you from learning chat GPT prompts to creating images and much more. Okay. You get the gist of it for that. Let's go ahead and now select this button text to video. Before you do that though, you see there's a few more options as far as the video ratio. And then you could even select a variety of voices to use for your voiceovers. But for this one, let's go ahead and then do text to video. This only takes about one to two minutes max, and you're going to have a full fledged video. Now, the cool thing about this is that although it may not turn out 100% perfect like you would like, remember, we are in a video editing tool, so it's very easy to replace any stock footage or anything and replace it with something else of our choice. But look at this, it's already done. And look at my timeline down here. So you saw the paragraph. I just typed. Just simply by typing in those sentences, it gives me everything that you see right here in my timeline. And like I said, if it's not perfect, it gives you an amazing starting point, some good ideas, and you could edit it as you go. Let's just go ahead and see what this crafted for us. Make sure you follow my YouTube channel to learn everything about the power of AI to create content or grow your business. With AI moving so fast, with so many new features, it's easy to feel overwhelmed. That's where my consulting calls come in. During our consulting sessions, I can teach you and show you everything you can do utilizing AI. Examples include learning chat GPT prompts, creating AI images, selling your digital product. But if you need a little more help, make sure you book a consultation call today. Okay, I don't know about you, but that's pretty impressive. Now, like I said, it may not be perfect. There might be some things you want to change, but just in two minutes, you're going to be able to get all of this just like that. So this is just actually the tip of the iceberg of what this tool can do. So if you like it and want to try it yourself, click the links in the description and then see what you think for yourself. But thank you so much for watching this video. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button because you'll be the first to know when all these videos come out. But until then, we'll see you next time.